Structural optimization allows creation of optimized geometric shapes for a variety of problems. However, this automation often comes at a cost. Optimized results often need to be manually rebuilt to fit into parametric design pipelines. Even otherwise structurally optimized shapes can be extremely hard to control, edit, or post-process. Typically, structural optimization methods operate on an oversampled initialization over a continuum or a graph structure. We take a different approach and compute a stress-aligned global parameterization on the input geometry. Tracing the parameter lines gives us a strong and smooth truss structure. These trusses can be utilized as independent structures or as reinforcement bars for solid structures made out of materials such as concrete. An important advantage of our approach is that parameter lines can be used to provide high-level parametric controls to the user and integrate structural optimization with parametric design. Some of these controls are extremely basic but intuitive, such as changing the radius of the truss elements or changing how dense the truss is. However, even these simple operations are near impossible to perform with existing structural optimization methods. Our method enables more complex parametric control, leading to the creation of unique structures such as this pavilion. The global parametrization allows an engineer to choose the set of curves aligned with the direction of maximum compression and replace them with thicker beams made out of a stronger material. The parametrization can also be used for more visual tasks. For instance, here an architect is able to easily select a curved family and combine structural optimization with the ancient Greek architectural motif of entesis. The designer selects the degree to which curves can be thickened and creates this novel marriage of ancient design principles and modern optimization techniques. We also created a proof-of-concept interface for performing these parametric edits in Fusion 360, which is a parametric CAD software. To validate our algorithm, we used 3D printing to fabricate our results and then mechanically tested them. For the first test, we took this optimized bending bar and compared it to an unoptimized regular truss. The test clearly shows that our optimized truss performs significantly better. We also compared to an existing truss optimization method and found that our structure performed much better. This bridge is made of ABS plastic, weighs 140 grams, and is optimized for bearing loads at the top. We stress tested this object by putting the weight of adult humans with successively increasing body weights on it. Starting with 52 kilograms, then 64 kilograms, 76 kilograms, and finally 93 kilograms. Please note that this is the same object that was used for all four tests. Even after the fourth test, we did not notice any structural failures. We also laser cut a wooden bike whose frame was optimized using our method. We tested it by letting a five-year-old ride it around. The bike was found to be structurally sound and its aesthetics were approved by our test subject. To see how our method helps build chairs, sculptures, bridges, and more, please see our paper.